This intro, we start at the B, seventh fret of your fourth string. To your sixth fret of second string. And we bounce back to this B, this seventh fret, on your thick string, every second note. Then going to nine on your third string. Use your dots, you got dots at seven and nine, use them. Then this. Dropping down a string to seven and six on your A string, your third string. And finish it out, top string, seven, nine, B, C sharp. If you need a tab for this to help you out, I've got a Patreon page. Just look in the video links below or the little tabs appearing above me now to take you through to my Patreon where you can grab a sheet to help you out. We play that and repeat it. And then move back two frets to the fifth fret. The only change will be the note we finish on. We've been finishing on the same string going. We're not going to do that this time. We're going to bounce back to the fourth fret. The C sharp is what that note is. Learn your fretboard. Uh, on your third string. That will take us into. Which we also use in the verse, so I'm going to teach you it as a part of the verse section. Pause this video, work on the intro, maybe go over to my Patreon and grab a sheet that will help you out. And when you're ready, let's have a look at the verse. For the verse, we've got this riff. That's going to be your whole verse. Really just learning one riff. The notes, seven, the B on your fourth string to the fifth of the B. If you don't know what root fifth playing is, once again, look in the video description below or the tab appearing above me now. It'll take you to my lesson on root fifth playing. Seven down to nine on your third string to 11 then back to 9 so B 9 11 9 happy trails it sounds like if I sing too much I get a copyright letter <laughs> then we take that back to the open position I'm playing the open fourth string, the E, two, four, two on your A string. Then the shape we did at seven and nine, back at two and four, the F sharp position. Two, four, six, four, two, four, six, four. at the end of the verse are just on your F sharp note second fret of the fourth string that's your verse pause this video look up my cover version as well link below or tab appearing above me now will take you to that where I play the song in full talk the way through the tune to help you learn it as well when you're ready let's look at the chorus the chorus is just a series of accented crotchets. Accents mean emphasizing the beat. We're gonna go B to C sharp to start out with. I'm gonna play that at second fret and fourth fret 
of the A string, the third string. So we got B, 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 C sharp, C sharp. Same rhythm to the open A, third string, back to B. Then G to A. Third fret to fifth fret on your fourth string. Guess what? That's the whole song. That is it. Look up my cover version to put all these parts in context. Uh, I'll just play the chorus in context. Uh, sing it in your head as you play it. Okay. Uh, and then it goes back to. And that is the song, as I said. If you've learned something from this video, why not subscribe to our channel, The Eastern Suburb School of Music, here on YouTube. Hundreds of bass lessons for you to learn from. Uh, click that thumbs up button. Give us a like. Helps other bass players discover us. Um, helps out this music school in 2021 as we crawl out of the wreckage of 2020. And if you've got any questions, comments, or even a request, please leave them on this video. I'll get around to answering them as soon as possible. Good luck learning California girls on your bass guitar. It's a real enjoyable one.